What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm a Clyde Priestess and Magician. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is this is free general collective reading for all signs, type suicide, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with the rest. Free general collective reading. Love you guys so much. We're 12,000. I mean, 13,000. <laughs> 13,210. Something like that. <laughs> Love and appreciate each and every one of you guys from the bottom of my heart chakra. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess Tarot 5. The link's in the description box below. PayPal only, no cash out, no Venmo. It's a very private, confidential way to donate. Um, love and appreciate each and every one of you guys from the bottom of my heart chakra. Okay, so I remember I told y'all I kept getting this one all day, to, three, three times today. The other one I got four times, so I'm offloading both of them. And then I'm going back walking. Just saying. Because that's my new favorite thing. Just saying, just saying. Okay. So, the, and this one isn't good. The other one was. This one's not. So, um, it's very important to only take the messages that resonate. These are psychic, intuitive, prophetic messages. So, it's very important to only take the messages that resonate. Leave the rest. Um, one may apply. Two may apply. Two plus may apply. None may apply. Only you know your situation story, not anybody else. Okay. All right. So, the channel message I received was... Um, um, Oh, confirmation from Fat Boy already. Come on, buddy. Come on. Okay, so the channel message I received was a feminine energy, strong meth addict, um, is having severe mouth pain. Severe. Um, for one, she's about to start losing. One, she's about to lose a tooth. And one, she's about to go in for a root canal. Um, but through many series of chain events, she's going to find out she's going to have to have teeth from uh, teeth removed um i don't know why this is so significant and important in the universe my god i've gotten three times today but apparently it is um it's a i heard she's specifically a fem energy and she's a meth addict um and it sounds like there's two of them in the universe because one i heard's about to just lose a tooth um i guess from the meth usage which i mean it, that crap happens. Trust me, I worked in a jail. I, I saw it. But I've seen meth addicts too, though, that have done it for years that don't lose teeth. So it really affects people in different ways. Um, and that's just the truth. But this one, at least for one of them, well, they're both going to lose teeth. One's going to lose teeth. It doesn't sound like they're going to go to the dentist. Um, and I don't know. I've never lost a tooth. Um, so I don't know how that works. And I'm not a meth addict, so I don't know how that works. That's one. The other one, um, I heard she's going to um, go to the dentist to get a root canal. Um, and she's going to still end up losing a tooth. But they're both meth addicts, both of them. Why they're so significant in here, I have no idea. Um, that's yikes. Yikes, yikes, yikes. The one about to go to the dentist is about to sh um, shell out a lot of money. And she's actually going to lose more than one tooth. Oh my God! Whoa. Um. So you plug in how it resonates. So the one one that's about to go to the dentist. Um. Heavy, heavy, heavy meth addict. Secret meth addict. Heavy, heavy, heavy meth addict. Secret meth addict. So the one about to go to the dentist is a secret meth addict. I guess the other one is. Maybe she is a secret meth addict. Maybe she's not. But it sounds like she's just going to lose teeth and move on. Um, severe mouth pain. Severe. Severe mouth pain. So it sounds like both of them have severe mouth pain. So I don't know. There's a free dental clinic, though. For anybody who doesn't know, there is here in Huntsville. There's a free, den free dental clinic. Um, I mean, of course, I think they only do basic, very basic services. And you have to be under a certain income to provide those services. Um, but I don't know. I don't know. But the, the one about to go to the dentist, apparently she either has the money to do this or she's going to borrow it or get it from somebody. I, or maybe it's going on the credit card. I don't know. But the one about um, one about to go to the dentist, I heard she's actually going, um, she's, it sounds like she's going in for root canal. But she's going to end up actually losing two or two plus teeth. Um, but she's a severe heavy meth addict too, but a secret one. 
Through many series of chain of events, it's going to be exposed in a way she would have never expected. And then a very important phone call is about to be made. Through many series of chain of events, it's going to be exposed in a way she would have never expected. And then a very important phone call is going to be made. So I don't, I don't think they give drug tests at the dentist. I mean, I don't know. It's been a while since I've been to the dentist, but I've never been administered a drug. How these, I'm wondering how these people are going to know she's a meth addict is what I'm trying to say. I wonder how they're going to know she's a meth addict. Because I heard through many series of chain of events, it's going to be exposed. that so basically she's a meth addict. And then somebody's going to make a very important phone call. I think to the police or she has child, child or children, child protective services or something. Um, what I'm saying is I've never been administered a drug test at the dentist. So maybe it's another place she's going to be administered a drug test. Somehow somebody's about to find out she's a meth addict. Either at the dentist or some other way. It might be she might get child protection service called on her. And um, they um, are suspecting drug use and that's how they find out. She might get a drug screen at her workplace. I've never I've never been administered a drug test. Drug drug screen at a dentist. So I don't think it's going to be from the dentist is what I'm saying. But it might be once she goes to the dentist and gets the root canal and then ends up losing all these teeth, people are going to catch on to it. Um, maybe some of her frenzies she gets it from or connections she gets it from outs her. I, mean, I don't know. But these people, they're, the message is important and appar apparently it's important for me to put it out. So there you go. I heard severe mouth pain. It's two fem energies. It sounds like one's going to go to the dentist, one is not. But for one that other one that's not going to go to the dentist, ma'am, there's free dental services. Very basic ones, but there are free dental services. I don't know what area you reside in. Um, but here in Huntsville, there are free de a free, de free dental clinic um, if you need it. Um, whoever you are, ma'am, just saying. Huge tower moments coming here. Huge. Huge tower moments coming here. Huge. Okay. I'm going to pull one witch's wisdom and then I'm going to close it. I mean, so negative tower moments here. Negative tower moments. I wonder, like, I've never had a, there's, it's been a while since I've been to the dentist, but there's ways for the one that's about to go for the root canal and about to basically have teeth extracted. There's ways they can put it. What's it called? Dental implants or something. They can put a fake tooth or teeth in there. I heard it's going to end up costing her a lot, a lot, a lot of money. So I think, well, root canals are not exp uh, not cheap. I've had a root canal before. I was real young uh, back when I was married. I was in my early 20s when I had a root canal done because um, I got hit in the face with the softball when I was a teenager and it just made it worse. So when me and my ex-husband got married, I was having um, my tooth was getting loose. And so, um, I mean, not severely loose, but a little loose. So I went to the dentist when we had insurance and um, they asked if I'd had any trauma to my mouth. And I told them what happened at that point. It was like four or five years ago or something like that from that time and um they said that trauma to the mouth can cause that other things etc 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 anyways i had to have a root canal done and um and this was in texas and um it was expensive even with insurance very expensive um so what i'm trying to say is it sounds like she's gonna have a root canal done but end up losing teeth in the process because of all this meth use, secret meth use. So, like, I never lost teeth. So, root canals in themselves are very expensive. So, I cannot imagine the cost incurred if she's going to get the uh, dental implants for the missing teeth. Um, I don't know. This is yikes. I don't know why this is so important, but I'm putting it out. Okay, I heard take it. We have the dark.
What was done in the dark is going to come to the light through many, 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 many series of chain events. This is going to be a huge, 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 huge cost occurred. And many negative tower moments are coming in this situation. Many. Okay, I heard what was done in the dark is coming to the uh, is coming to the light, and basically huge negative tower moments coming here, and um, um, it's going to be revealed. It sounds like the dark here in this aspect is what was done in the dark is coming to the light, i.e., the secret meth use. Uh, well, I'm pulling in the one that's going to go to the dentist. Roll heavy that fem energy. Um, this other fem energy, ma'am. There's free dental services. Um, you, I know there is in Huntsville, Alabama. You might want to Google it or ask somebody in your community about free dental services. If you need, like if it gets cracked or something, maybe they can extract the cracked tooth. Um, if anybody needs to hear that. But the one about to go to the dentist, I'm pulling her in very, very, very strong. But um, was, I think in both of these situations, what was done in the dark is coming to the light as far as the secret meth use. Um somehow this one's about to be exposed for the secret meth use it doesn't sound like this one is going to be maybe she gets exposed maybe she doesn't but this one the one about to go to the dentist is about to in a huge way a way she would have never expected in a huge way in a way she would have never expected yeah i'm pulling her in so strong so what was done in the dark is coming to the light basically with the dark energy because um, this can be interpreted in many different ways, but in this way, it's what's done in the dark is coming to the light. Man, yeah, Lord. All right, let me see if I hear anything else. K D C P K D C P is what I heard. A K D C P A K D C P A. So K is in kite. D is in um dog uh c is in cat p is in um pigskin and a is in apple so k is in kite d is in dog c is in cat uh p is in pigskin a is in apple you plug it in how it resonates that i feel in those initials could be a first middle or a last initial of one of these people or maybe one of you guys that knows one of these people because we're pulling these two people in fem secret meth addicts very strong one's going to go to the dentist one's not but you guys i think you guys know these people um and it's about to go very badly for this one i mean very badly this person's about to get exposed in a huge way so however those initials resonate it could i feel it could be a first middle or last initial one of these people or a first middle or last initial one of you guys or somebody you know connected to the situation it might be a first, middle, or the last initial of the dentist or dental staff about to take care of this person. Or a first, middle, or last initial of the person that's going to be called. Because I heard a very, somebody's about to find out about this meth usage for the person about to go to the dentist through many series of chain of events. And then a porn phone call is going to be made. So it could be the people about to get involved when they find out this person has secretly been using meth. I'm not sure, only you know you're storing out anybody else, but it was very important for me to bring this one out, so I am. Um, love you guys. I hope everybody has a good night, and namaste.